Good morning and welcome back to my social media group, Grow Your Maths and Science Like a Superhero. And we can uh, do a five minute talk and look at the human digestive system and some of the enzymes involved. So if we're looking at the structure of the digestive system, and remember biology is systems, organs, tissues and cells. So we start with the salivary glands, three different types, parotid, submandibular and sublingual. And we've got the oral cavity, pharynx, tongue, esophagus going down into the pancreas, stomach and pancreatic duct. We've got the liver and the different structures of the colon. So there's a function of each, chewing, mouth called mastication, and the saliva contains enzymes which break down food products. Esophagus moves food by the process called peristaltis, which is contraction and relaxation of muscle and the stomach controlling movement of food into and out of um, the small intestine, releasing gastric juices at a very low pH containing water, enzymes, mucus, and acid being hydrochloric acid. The small intestine, we've got liver and the pancreas secrete various enzymes into it, which completes the digestion and absorption of nutrients through the intestinal walls, and then the colon. So the colon, contains bacteria which produce some of the vitamins. Vitamins absorbed into the bloodstream, reabsorbs water and moves out. So a little bit about the function of digestion of carbohydrates. Remember carbohydrates contain carbon, hydrogen and oxygen. So in the mouth, we have an enzyme called amylase which breaks starch into sugar being glucose and the stomach we haven't, well, amylase doesn't work because of the pH. And in the small intestine, we have neutralizing acids and various others. So mechanical digestion occurs in the mouth, whereas in the stomach, we have gastrin hormone signals to secrete acid and an enzyme called pepsinogen, which, uh, which digest is broadly speaking a digestive enzyme. And in the intestine, trypsin, again, another type of enzyme, which digests proteins into amino acids. And the third type, which is fat digestion. So this uses an enzyme called lipase secreted from the pancreas, which splits fat into fatty acids and glycerol. And I've gone on to a little bit of what carbohydrates and uh, sugars and also peptides are in one of my other talks. Thank you very much.